Hi friends, welcome to my channel. My name is Deborah, and this is Deborah After 50, where I showcase fashion, makeup, shopping from the perspective of a 50 plus year old woman. Today's video is a Kmart haul. I can't wait for Kmart to reopen. Although I'm getting my retail fix through shopping online, it's not the same as walking through a store. I find that when I'm on shopping online, I don't get the visibility of the whole store. I get bored with having to scroll through all the categories, so I end up missing out. Perhaps if you find that there is something that you've recently bought that I might like, please let me know in the comments below. I'm always looking out for something new to buy from Kmart. And am I the only one who's just realized that you can do click and collect? I've been buying online and getting it delivered to my house, but I was finding that in the case of the last order, I placed it about a month ago and it took came out about three weeks. And I understand they're inundated with orders at the moment and COVID is wrecking havoc with everything. But anyway, it took a little while. But in the meantime, I had to get my fix somehow and I found I stumbled on Click and Collect. Kmart provides that if you place your order by midday today, you can essentially pick it up by late this afternoon, provided it's available in store close to you. And I've been able to do that recently. So I've stocked up on a little bit extra than what I'd ordered online to provide this haul today. If you like this haul, sit back, grab a drink. I'm thirsty. And this is a Twinies infusion, lemon, orange, and ginger. And it is so refreshing and delicious. Anyway, sit back, enjoy your drink, and enjoy my video. And if you like this content, please give it a thumbs up. And my RC is subscribed, that way you don't miss out on any future content. I hope you enjoy this video. Today's video is going to be broken up into three categories, fashion, storage, and kitchen. I found that I've bought a fair few things in every category. So let's start with the fashion items. The first item that I purchased was a fedora hat. Here it is. It is a neutral colour in black with cream. And I think it's something that I can wear all through summer, whether I go to the beach or whether it's just lounging in the backyard because we're still in lockdown by then. Hopefully it will be the former rather than the latter. But this is only $9 and it's a fedora hat from a Kmart and it's one size fits all. I like it. I think I can style it really well over the summer holidays. So I've purchased two white t-shirts. These are the boyfriend t-shirts and I'll insert a little video here so you can see what they look like on me. I'm a size 14 at the moment and I, I like my t-shirts to sit uh, baggy on me so that they don't um, emphasize any extra roles that I'm currently sporting. Um, and I found the cotton is, is really soft and it's perfectly white. It's a lovely cool white tone um, that goes well with jeans, over leggings even. I also saw these, these black jogger jeans. They're $25. They have pockets and a tie at the front. Again, I'll insert how I've worn them here to the right so you can see what they look like on my size 14 frame. They have the ends are rolled up at the bottom. And it's a very soft cotton, uh, very forgiving on the body. I found that it was a perfect fit on me as a size 14. And I do tend to be a little bit pear shaped. So I carry a little bit extra weight around my hips and bottom and heavy top of my thighs. But this was really good. It fit well and I enjoyed it. On the same vein, I saw that they had a similar style in jeans. So I bought the tapered extra high rise jeans. And this is what they look like on top. So they've got the little seams that and they're elasticized all the way around with a flat panel at the front and they have the little stitching at the bottom to also gather it in um, you'll see what it looks like on the side here on me i have to say um these are also size 14 but they weren't forgiving on me at all they had they didn't have enough stretch um, in the areas that i have problem with on my body so unfortunately i'm going to have to return them they're lovely and perhaps i'm not sure unfortunately it's so difficult at the moment returning things because you can't just walk into a store and choose the right size or even try them on buy online you do unfortunately have to take a gamble and this time it didn't pay off i didn't find that these suited my frame unfortunately hopefully we come out of lockdown and i'll be able to return these in store and try on a size 16. i saw this peach camisole online and I'll insert it in here on me so you can see what it looks like. And I love it. It has a peasant style and it's very drapey and flowy. And you can see that I tried it on the jeans um, 
I wouldn't wear them with that color of blue jean. It was just too much of a contrast, maybe with white jeans or cream jeans that look a little bit different or maybe even faded pale blue jeans. But I liked it. Um, this I will definitely wear. It is long sleeved and it does have some gathering at the top there and gathering along the top of the sleeve. And at the wrist, it's gathered. And join with this cute little button. I liked it. This one I will definitely keep. Another item that I purchased is a turquoise dress. This is the tiered midi dress in this lovely um, watercolour. I think this will look so pretty in the summertime. I've started up here with some tan um, sandals and gathered it in the waist with a thin belt to show a little bit of definition on my figure. But this is a lovely colour. I think it would look lovely in the summertime. It is light and breezy. It has three gathered panels and it is so lightweight and breezy. I'm, I think it's gonna be fabulous in those really warm summer days. I can't wait to wear it. I bought some yoga leggings and I love these because I love the crossover um, at the waist here uh, that it has. I tried on and you can see it up here. They're very comfortable. The fabric is really soft and forgiving and stretchy. It does have a pocket at the back where you can put, not necessarily your phone, but you can definitely put your car keys when you go to the gym once they open again. And, and this comes in black and it was only $18. Something else that I purchased was these cute little hoop earrings. I'll try them on for you so you can see what they look like on me. There you go. Aren't they pretty? They have a mother of pearl insert and they're gold. I think it's very pretty. It's not too big. Like, I mean, these are a statement earring um, and I wore them for the video today. I think they give a nice summery vibe. And uh, these were also from Kmart, but these were last year. This is current. Uh, they're gold hoops with the mother of pearl insert. And on the same vein, I bought some more hoop earrings. These are a bit chunkier and these were reduced to $2. Does I say how much? These were $4 and their current stock from Kmart. And these were in the clearance section and these are $2. And I'll show you what these look like. There you go. These are very lightweight. They look like they'd be heavy. They're actually very lightweight and they don't look too chunky at all on the ear as well. So, hmm, I like those. These were only $2, grab them, snap them up because they're a bargain. And last item in clothing was these slippers. These are the women's scuff slippers in cream and they have a rubber sole so you can wear them outside. And they were reduced to $5, so they were a bargain. I wear a size 9, 10. I like them to be nice and comfy when I put them on. And now we move to home decor. I needed to restock my fresh flowers candle. I love this one in my last haul. Oh, it is divine. And it burnt so well, it burnt all the way to the bottom. There was practically nothing left of the candle. We know when you buy some candles and as you burn it, the wax gathers along the sides of the jar. With this candle, it didn't. And I do only normally burn them for a couple of hours and then turn them off um, regardless. But with this candle, it burnt all the way down to the bottom. So I felt I really got my money's worth. And this is only $15. It's a bargain. I also bought another candle. This was on sale. I can't remember how much it was, but it was reduced. It's the Fragrant Candle in Citrus. And it smells divine. I'm going through a bit of a decluttering stage in the house. Uh, we're spending so much extra time at home that we have a bit more time on our hands. And I saw Kmart had this a magnetic laundry caddy. It has a magnetic strip at the back that sticks to your metal appliances like washing machine or a dryer. And I'm gonna use it to store the lint from my dryer. Another storage item that I purchased is the hanging handbag holder. And this is made of felt. And when you open it, so you store in your wardrobe on a hook, and you hold your handbags um, attached, attached to these felt tabs that close. I'll see if I can insert a picture of what it looks like when it's hanging in the wardrobe. Something else that I purchased on the veins of storage are these under shelf metal hooks. So this is what it looks like. So this slides onto the shelf and you can hang mugs on it um, in your kitchen or in the case of my wardrobe, but perhaps handbags. I'll have to see which is the best way of utilizing these, but I thought these would be really handy in a number of um, situations. While we're in the homeware section, I purchased some storage items. One of them I saw from the Sunday stylist uh, put me onto it. She's a YouTuber on YouTube. 
I suggest you watch because she's got some great ideas on storage and just maintaining a tidy home. And she introduced me to these uh, wide and high stackable roller storage boxes and they are fabulous. I've purchased a few of them because I've redone my pantry and these are really good. You can put bottles in them, you can put cans, you can put um, packets of chips so they don't just fall all over the cabinet. Um, and I found these are really, really good value and good quality at Kmart. They're actually similar to something that you can buy at Bunnings. And at Bunnings, they're about $4 more expensive than at Kmart for something similar. The next item that I bought are these set of three cotton vegetable bags. And I opened them and they are three calico bags. This is for garlic, so you can store garlic in them. This one's for onions and they open up at the bottom. So I think I'll probably be able to get eight onions in here and they are so cute. I'm planning on putting them in my pantry so that I've got my onions neatly in these calico bags and they have one for potatoes. The potatoes is substantially bigger. There it is. And it's got a drawstring closing. So you can put your potatoes safely in a calico bag, nice and neat. And because it's got black lining inside, it protects it from the light. I think these are adorable. And they're in the storage section of Kmart. I bought this three pack usable cake tin liners. I enjoy baking and I do use baking paper when I bake, but this looks like a more environmentally friendly option. This is what they look like. Three pieces in a pack. We would insert in the tin and the sides rise up. I insert a picture here um, so it looks a little bit clearer. And one last thing, I saw that Kmart had uh, body scrubs, coffee body scrubs, and I decided to buy the Uplift coffee and coconut body scrub, dry body scrub, just to see what it feels like. Uh, I'm looking forward to using this. And lastly, in kitchen. In my kitchen, I have white plates. There's, although they're very versatile, there's nothing wrong with them. I felt that I needed a little bit of a change in the kitchen. So I saw that Kmart had these gorgeous plates in this gorgeous caramel color, caramel with a white ring. And I decided to buy just enough for my family. I bought six of each of the large bowls, the large dinner plate. These are substantial size plates. I also got the matching butter plates or the side plates and the small cereal bowls. These are so gorgeous. It's such a lovely summery spring color. And I have the matching placemats uh, in the same color. I'll, ins I'll insert a picture here to show you what it looks like once it's all set up. But these are gorgeous. I think they were only I'll insert a price up here so you can see how much they cost. I don't think they were more than $3 each um, from memory, but these were gorgeous. I just love them. It's a little bit different to what I'm currently using. It'll give us a bit of a feel of a holiday at home. We're using different crockery. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this haul. There were some gorgeous finds that I found. And if you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. And if you've purchased any of these items, please let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear that. And also, if there's anything you think that I should look into, please let me know that also. <laughs> I'm never shy of shopping. <laughs> anyway, thank you very much for sharing your time with me. Hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.